To beat World 1, you have to play these levels. After you beat 1-3, you have a choice to either play this level or this level. It doesn't matter which one you pick because after you beat either one, you unlock Bowser's Castle. As you can see, I have my blindfold and my scarf, and at the end of the video, I'll prove that I can't see through them. And if you think that somebody is playing for me off screen, I'll do a live stream later to prove that that's not the case. Okay, without further ado, let's do 1-1. Let's go! Am I not looking left? I should be looking left. Okay, that was weird. I'm in the water? What? Okay, I'm big time lost right now. Where's the pipe? Hold on, I gotta reset. Don't know how I missed the pipe the first time, but we're good. So before I beat this level, I want to collect one more cat bell in case something goes wrong later in the run. There we go, I'm in the pool. Oh my gosh, I'm lost. I have to restart. Finally! How did I butcher that last time? I must not have been looking straight up or down. Okay, that was a rough start. I promise the rest of the video is not going to look like that. Beautiful. Wait, hold on. Okay, got it. All right, as soon as I hear the music, I'm gonna count to K or L. I mean, sing. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, G. Sweet, both in one shot. I usually miss one and have to get the other one later.
Should be lined up now. Hopefully I'm looking straight up. One of the biggest challenges of this blindfold run is making sure I'm looking straight up and not slightly to the left or right, because that can ruin everything. Lock in, come on. Yes, I didn't die. Oh my gosh, that's huge. Those are extremely hard to time, and that's probably one of the hardest things of this run. So I gotta listen if I'm holding straight up. Okay, I wasn't holding straight up. If I was holding straight up, I would have hit the dash pad. So I gotta figure out if I'm on the left side or the right side of the warp pipe. Okay, I might I might be on the left side. Yep. There's the bushes. Beautiful. Thank goodness for indicators. All right, Bowser's Castle. Be kind to me. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 2. Okay, here we go. Let me explain what happened. My controller started drifting. While I was jumping around going nowhere, I was holding up on the analog stick, but my controller drifted to neutral as if I wasn't touching it at all. This hasn't happened in a long time, but of course it happens during a video. This is why I'm so lost. Where the heck am I? I jumped over the soccer ball? What the heck? I've never done that before. Hold on, I gotta... I'm lost. I messed up. Not hitting... Not hitting that soccer ball threw me off. There it is. Yes, okay. Got that Tower of Goombas. We got one more over here.
missed it. All right, almost there, guys. Come on. Ooh, I really hope I look straight up. It's such an issue. One. Two. Three. Oh, I messed up. I messed up. I have to restart because that, that, that ruins everything. Okay, let's try this again from scratch. One. Two. Okay, so now he's going to roar and then throw three more, I think. Okay, he needs two more hits. I should be able to do one more before he jumps. Okay, go, go, go. Yes! Oh my gosh, freaking yes. Yes, okay, proof time. I gotta make sure I stay in the frame. So nobody thinks there's some tomfoolery going on. Where's my flashlight? Okay. Here's the flashlight. If you can't see the light, I'm sorry, let me, let me talk into the mic. If you can't see the light, then I can't see through the thing. If you guys have any doubts of me faking this run, please leave them in the comments and I can respond to them. Thank you so much for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, please like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.